And Barkhada also exclusively spoke to Pakistan's Foreign Secretary. He called the meeting between the two Prime Ministers constructive, but also raised Pakistan's security concerns in Balochistan. Shareef, let's talk to Pakistan's uh, Foreign Secretary. Sir, let me start by asking you, what is uh, the adjective you'd use to describe the outcome of this meeting? I think it was a very positive and constructive meeting. As I mentioned, that um, uh, high-level interactions are always, they produce very positive results, and I have absolutely no doubt that this interaction that has taken place today will also produce very positive results. Was it disappointing that there was no joint statement? No, I think the, uh, we don't have to. Uh, I think the position was uh, uh, made clear by the, uh, by the respect, by, uh, uh, National Security Advisor Shimshek Shankar Manor and our side. There were some tangible, tangible outcome of this meeting as well. There was an unseemly controversy in the run-up to this meeting uh, uh, about Hamid Mir having alleged that a pejorative description, the Hathi Aurat, was used for the Indian Prime Minister. I was at the same breakfast meeting that was referred to. I heard absolutely no such thing, in my presence at least. Has the government of Pakistan sought a clarification from Hamid Mir as to why this needless controversy was created? I think the, uh, Mr. Hamid Mir has also denied that he has also clarified this position. So has it been denied? He has been already denied. How soon will the... A DGMOs meet on the issue of the LOC? I think the DGMOs um, should meet soon because uh, this is a decision that has been taken at the highest level. And uh, the um, maintaining this ceasefire is uh, again of uh, equal importance to both countries. And lastly, the funding by the Punjab government of the Jamaat of Dawa, something that India raised. Your comments on that? Well, um, I think there is a lot of misunderstanding with regard to the funding provided by the by Punjab government to Jam Jamaat Dawa institutions. These institutions were uh, t taken over by Punjab government. The institutions which were uh, being run by this organization were taken over by Punjab government in compliance of the UN Security Council resolution, which had uh, uh, put under these o these organizations un uh, under sanctions. So uh, accordingly, uh, as uh, directed by the federal government, these institutions were taken over. And the Punjab government is imparting and running those schools as part of the government schools uh, in order to impart. But India them. doesn't accept that with Hafiz Said out and free. Well, uh, but the point is that uh, uh, the institutions are being run by the Punjab government and Hafiz Said has, has got absolutely no, no role in the, uh, uh, with these institutions. Jalil Jalani, thank you so much for talking to us. Pakistan's Foreign Secretary there saying that Hamid Mir uh, himself has now retracted his uh, remarks and also going on to say that although not much came out of this meeting, whatever happened in itself is something that he would describe as constructive.